if I have to go downstairs to iron, I ain't never gonna iron. Y'all gonna see me wrinkled everywhere I go. Hi British Vogue, I'm Charlie XCX and this is what's in my bag. parking garage of Whole Foods. I am about to uh, head into Whole Foods and buy some food. I am off of work today, as you guys can tell. Off of work, but still on work because I did a lot of YouTube work today. We just left the coffee shop. I think it's pronounced Tate's. I'm not 100% sure, but I think so. The double T kind of throws me off. It actually was really, really good. I had a decaf uh, oat milk latte, which was so delicious. Uh, and I also had breakfast there. It was all right. I mean, I just prefer home cooked meals. You know what I'm saying? But it did what it needed to be, what needed to be done. The bacon actually was really, really good. And then I had that uh, pear pastry. To be honest with you, I got it because it looked good um, or it looked interesting. I don't like pear at all. But I did think for a second that, you know, okay, it's a, a, a tart. Like it might actually be delicious because I think that pear tastes good. I just don't like the consistency. Like, I don't like the way it feels um, when I'm chewing it up. But anyway, we're gonna, it's beautiful outside. So I could not have chosen a better day to be off. I'm actually going to be off for a few days working on YouTube stuff. But of course, you guys know my number one priority is my health. And so I want to start off today instead of waiting till tomorrow by going to go get my groceries so that I can eat properly this weekend high iron high vitamin c that's the name of the game so i'm gonna run in here i'm gonna pick up some things like for breakfast i pick up some things that i'm gonna have be able to have for lunch and dinner um while i'm at home and uh keep it moving so come on let's run inside here because i really want to get back to the chateau and chill for a little bit so
guys we are back at the chateau i've only been here probably for about an hour i put away all the groceries and everything and we'll probably go through that at some point this weekend because i definitely got a meal prep for next week and we'll be cooking at you know different points throughout the weekend but anyway i had no plans on going anywhere this evening but you guys already know how it goes always 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 a monkey wrench thrown in my personal plans but also things i want to do because your girl is starving so i'm about to go out for a quick casual dinner really quick and i should be back home in time enough to still handle some things around the house but i just wanted to check in with y'all real quick i'm actually about to iron the pants that i want to wear i am i'm gonna do a tiktok of me getting dressed but i still wanted to share it with you guys real quick so these cargo pants and it's not coming across on camera the way that the color actually looks it's kind of like a like slime green i have an addiction to slime green during the fall actually not even just during the fall because i love wearing it in the summer i'll even wear it in the winter if it's like a winter item i definitely have like a dress a sweater dress that's that color i have these cargo pants a jacket t-shirt anything i can get my hands on with this particular color and again from what i'm seeing it's not coming across on camera properly but I would describe it as slime green you guys when i do the tiktok i'm gonna record it on my phone and i think that the color is exact i think it's super duper cute I, um, I bought these from target these little cargo pants from target they're wide leg i want to wear these with a little tank and let me see i don't have the tank in here but let me show y'all well what did i do with the tank I don't know what the tank where the tank is right now and I don't have a lot of time to wait I'll show it to you guys once I pull my outfit together anyway I'm about to go ahead and iron these items I just put my ironing board up y'all I can't stand ironing no freaking lie I cannot stand it and I know I am not the only one I don't want to be wrinkled but I cannot stand having to pull out the ironing board and the iron which is why I have one in my bedroom I have one downstairs in my washroom um for the household to share but I have one in my bedroom because if I have to go downstairs to iron I ain't never going to iron. Y'all going to see me wrinkled everywhere I go. Um, but anyway, yeah, I want to um, iron these. And then I wanted to share a little tip with you guys because one of the things that I do for my appliances, like my iron, because this thing wasn't cheap, okay? And I like to keep it nice and clean and clear. And you know, like a lot of people's irons, no fault of their own because they may or may not know, a lot of people irons have like the brown, like burnt gook on them. Sometimes from spray starch I totally understand that but then sometimes from the water that they use because not everyone's water is mineral free like I have a well um, at the chateau so I definitely would have a lot of brown cook if I used the water from out of the tap but instead of doing that I buy distilled water and that's what I use and this came from Target like the hugest jug I can get because I use it for all of my appliances like I have a hair steamer and that's what made me even start looking into it because I have like the hooded hair steamer and you guys will see that one day whenever I do my hair uh, and it only takes distilled water because again the minerals and all of the things that are in your water um, if it's not filtered will get stuck in the appliances and make it look very very nasty so i always use distilled water even in my face steamer for skincare i pour distilled water in there and um and it it stays pristine nice and clean you know so anyway i wanted to share that with you guys but let me go ahead and iron these pants and i'm gonna see y'all when i finish getting dressed Can't believe we made it. Ooh. This 
This is what we thank for. If you upgrade your I can, oh, can I oh, let me up, but I Oh, love, they don't love you like I love you Slow down, they don't love you like I love you Me, myself, and I, that's all I got in the end That's what I found out And it ain't no need to cry I took a vow that from now on I'm gonna be my own best friend You wake up, do flawless Post up, flawless Riding around in that flawless Flossing on that flawless Can you see her? I like to meet her What you said? She ain't no diva I'll be put in the cold Time to ring the alarm Cause you ain't never seen a fire like the one I'ma cause To the left, to the left You must not know about me You must not know about me I can have another you by tomorrow So don't you ever for a second get to thinking You're irreplaceable Welcome to Saturday. We're in the Chateau kitchen, but as y'all saw, we went and got my nails done, and here they are. Let me get my face out of it so you can see. But of course, you know, I have my aesthetic recordings that I'm gonna put in so you guys can really see it. It's burgundy and gold. And the people who love the commanders, they're gonna say that the colors are for the commanders, but no, baby. I am not into, even though, you know, I'm from the DMV, so, um, the commanders would be the team if I had one. I'm not interested in sports whatsoever, so I'm not claiming it. This inspo came from this bag right here. I brought it down here so that I could show you guys because this is what I'm carrying tomorrow. You see the gold, you see the burgundy. It's just the jam, okay? So, um, so yeah, it was inspired by Christian Dior, honey, not the commanders do not put that on me i know my daughter is just gonna roll her eyes when she sees this anyway i just been chilling for the most part today i went and got my nails done as you guys saw i took you all along with me and i am actually about to get ready i really shouldn't even be on this camera my behind should be getting ready right now i'm about to go over a friend's house for a game night she's having a game night tonight which should be fun takia you guys probably this time around you guys haven't met Takia but in older videos absolutely you've met her and you won't see her again because we're gonna go do karaoke on a Tuesday at Mary Lou's and let me tell y'all she is a funky good time so I can't wait for y'all to meet her tonight but then for us to go to Mary Lou's that right there is in the works because quite a few people hit me up and asked me like next time you go let me know and I'll go so it's gonna be a group of us let me know in the comments if any of y'all are in the DMV and you want to join us up there I'll definitely make sure I share the date and time anyway after I got my nails done y'all I finally 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 got my liquid chlorophyll so I'm about to get some of that just so that I can drink it while I'm getting ready I have no idea what I'm gonna wear I'm also starving so I'm drinking one of these juices that I got from Whole Foods and this one right here is the belly something or another let me see belly rub juice and I'm assuming that it's supposed to help rub it away okay because it's cabbage pear pineapple parsley mint and ginger root it's actually really really good so if you're ever in whole foods you have one in your area definitely check that out so i'm gonna drink that i'm gonna go get ready i have no idea what i'm about to put on so i'm gonna see y'all once i figure that out and i get my clothes on maybe before i get them on but once i figure it out While his father was sleeping, right? And he wanted to go to this Love and basketball. To this little jammy jam, right? To get house party. Mm -hmm. Oh. And then this one, this woman said. I've never seen house party. Like this. we can see your pictures. Oh, so. oh, 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 boomerang. Uh -huh. And then this one right here. Hold up, say Marcus again. Marcus. <laughs> Marcus. So, remember a couple of What was her name? 
Eartha Kitt. Eartha yeah. Kitt. No, but wasn't there another one in Boomerang? Oh. The one who Listen, was. Oh, uh, yes, yes, Strong J. I don't yes. remember her name, though. Yes. Hold up, but, but she's the Grace Grace Jones. Grace Jones. Yes, yes, that's yes, yes. Because yes, yes. uh-huh. I remember her with that whip. <laughs> but, Listen, I didn't blur it out. the movie, but anywho. So, remember back, I mean, a couple of cards ago, and y'all said this man, right? Mm. Um, Keep my neck, my Did wife's it? neck out. Yes. So, what do you do? Smack somebody? Who Chris, he, Chris, Chris Rock? Rock? Chris Rock. Okay, well, oh. what, what's his... Comedian? Mm-mm. What's uh, his... Um, Fresh Prince? Mm-mm. No. Um, the movie that we were talking about that he was in? What's his? What was his name? Pookie. Mm-hmm. Oh, New Jack City. Mm-hmm. I was like, what? Oh, I'm like, Will Smith was Pookie mm-hmm. in a movie? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Child, I was lost. Winslow. No, just Carl. Just Carl. Carl. Uh-huh. Okay. And then clothing. And that. Carl Kanai. Mm-hmm. Oh my god, that, that brand. I remember I had the you shirt. You can do like Mont- Montel Jordan. Huh? Oh, you know he sings a song when he's in his Carl Kanai. Oh, um. Oh, uh-huh. oh, uh-huh. gotta get the groove. Oh, yeah. Okay, um. I would have never got that. <laughs> no, no. Alright, one word. Uh, it's like a. The key of faces be making me nervous. <laughs> and it's just the game. I can't think of this one. She's gonna get you. Mm-hmm. Like, she I am. She's too busy really singing the song on her horn. Okay, okay. okay. She's trying to think okay. now. She two the song. words. I can't even say it. Okay. Um. Two. It's a two-parter. Do y'all remember Mac Daddy and Daddy Mac? Yes, Chris yes, Cross. Cross. Okay. The first word that y'all just said. Chris. Yes. Um. You said word. Chris Tucker. No. Chris, Chris Rock. Chris Rock. Chris. Okay, I can do Chris other Brown, things. Than Chris Weber. Purple. Blue. Chris, cross, cross colors. Color. Cross colors. Cross colors. Oh. oh. You told us. Yeah, you said Chris. Hey, sweet thing. How you doing, baby? All you got to say is, I'm okay, mister. What is it, um, outcast, fresh and so clean? Um, okay, Yep. Yeah. No, 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 no. We can't let them sit that close. They got inside connections going on. All right, y'all, we are back at the chateau. I, um, I had a funky good time so thank you thank you thank you to Kia for inviting me we played quite a few games and they all were enjoyable but my favorite was the last one uh Singo and it's like a music bingo anyway I uh definitely had a funky good time but I'm about to go to bed because we got a lot to do tomorrow I have a photo shoot that I'm gonna be doing my son and I we're gonna go out and we're gonna prepare for some Instagram posts that I have coming up and then after that y'all know we're gonna go and celebrate 9-22 a 22 anniversary um, and go out on a solo date so that should be a good time I am going to see you guys tomorrow morning I should-
Hey, what's up, you guys? Welcome to Sunday. Y'all are on a steering wheel right now, so y'all not gonna be able to stay there for too long. This car does not have anywhere for me to put my camera, but I wanted to check in with you all and forgive the shift and like I don't even know if I'm going to use this footage but we are on our way to the solo day we're going to Philippe Chow and it is in the wharf um like a new harbor in Washington DC I actually hate going there because parking is horrible but um but anyway doesn't matter I'm gonna go I'm gonna celebrate you know 922 just it being the 22nd and do my little solo day thing I already know what I'm going to order y'all I did my research before I made the reservation so that I know exactly what your girl is going to feast on. And it's actually my first meal of the day because today I think I just had like peanut butter crackers. I did a little bit of running around. I, um, you guys know I went to the grocery store on Friday, but I needed to get a particular ingredient that I needed for a pasta that I'm going to make tomorrow. Um, and I'm going to do like some short form content on that. So you guys will see it, but it won't be in this vlog. But, uh, but yes, yeah, so I went and got heavy cream because that was the ingredient that I needed. And then I came back home and I chopped up all of the vegetables that we got on Friday when we went to the grocery store. Just so that all of that is just prepared for me to do my meal prep for the week. Uh, but I didn't have enough time to like actually pull the salads together. So, um, so yeah, I'll do that. I'll probably will just do that in the morning. I'm actually okay with like making the salad every Every morning before I go to work um, just as long as I have food to eat and I also like chopped up everything that I'll be able to make my breakfast easily and maybe even a snack it just all depends on what I decide to eat but anyway so I got that done definitely a productive Sunday I did some research for YouTube. You guys know that's what this weekend has been all about. Like me doing research on content ideas and places I can go and things that I can do. Um, but for now, we're not going to worry about any of those things. We are going to go and have a funky good time in my own company. I'm going to tell you guys that once upon a time, I would never have gone out by myself. But just through the journey, I had to learn to love spending time with me. And I'm going to tell you, it's literally one of my favorite things to do love hanging with my family definitely love hanging with my kids but um but no it's one of my favorite things to do just uh hanging alone and just being able to focus on myself and my happiness right because it's a little selfish if you're focused on yourself uh, and you have other people present right so I just opt to be alone and focus on me you know so anyway, my son, he is with his dad and they're hanging out. And then my daughter, she's out doing her own thing. You know what I mean? She's she about to be 25, y'all. Homegirl ain't thinking about me. So anyway, I'm just happy that I did the exercise to enjoy my own company so much so that I'll do anything and everything alone and thoroughly enjoy, like show myself a good time. Not just a good time, but a funky good time. Last night, speaking of a funky good time, was actually a really, really good time. I'm so thankful for Takia for um, for inviting me um, to her game night. I even met some ladies that were like super duper cool. One of us exchanged numbers so that we can go, you know, hang out and have coffee. Um, so that'll be cool. Maybe you guys will meet her on the channel. But anyway, I'm going to focus on the road y'all keep falling i'm not even going to include that oh maybe i will include that i don't know but i'm going to focus on the road and i will see you guys once we get to the restaurant oh and today's the first day of fall so i pulled out you know my burgundy for fall mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. oh yeah and my nails uh they are burgundy and gold i think i showed you guys that yesterday but today's the first day of fall so i had to get my fall on fall and spring that's my time to come alive all right y'all we made it and it is so crazy because this is the, the easiest it's ever been for me to come to the wharf i actually hate this place because it's always so so busy and i guess on sunday evenings it's not as busy but um but y'all let me tell you like it's been so ridiculous you can't find any parking at all like people driving around waiting for other people to pull out because it's a lot of restaurants a lot of good restaurants it's beautiful y'all are about to see but um anyway i'm about to put my shoes on i didn't get to do a OOTD but I'm gonna show y'all whenever we get out of the car to the best of my ability anyway the highlight for me is my bag like I've been wanting to carry it so so bad my little Dior clutch and the big Z on the end um and you can like hang things from it but I'm not a I'm not a charm girl so I'm not gonna be hanging anything this chain right here 
I saw that it had the little loops on the sides so that you can put a chain on it. And I just happen to have purchased this one from Coach. But I have a lot of bags like this size from Coach, like leather bags from Coach. And um, none of them came with like a chain like this. I like the chain link chain. Uh, so I just threw it on because I figure coming down here, I'm gonna be in a place and space where there are a lot of people and I didn't wanna be holding it, you know, like in my hand like this, just in case, especially with this on the edge, cause somebody might try to snatch it out of my um, hand so I figure I'll just put the chain on it and wrap it around my body honey and um and just keep it moving just like that we actually are quite a bit early like I'm 30 minutes early I am gonna still go straight to the restaurant though and see if they'll let me just go ahead and sit down and get the party started so I can get home early because I ain't mad at that at all so anyway let me put these shoes on and I didn't show y'all my shoes but they are just some gucci platforms super easy because it's a uh, cobblestone up there um so super easy to walk in plus dressy enough for the restaurant i mean my outfit's really really casual so not dressy at all but it's gonna work today okay it's gonna work today anyway let me finish putting my shoes on and i'm gonna see y'all when i get out the car Okay, we're here, but I don't know exactly where to go. So I'm gonna figure that out and see y'all in a second. I was looking for it and it literally was right in front of me, right here. So let's go and see if they will allow me to go ahead and sit down and eat now. And if not, it's beautiful out here. Um, so I can walk around and show you guys the the wharf but if not we'll just come back another day let's see what the what is oh wait i forgot to show you guys my outfit basic betty-ish all right let me go in here
Y'all, these king crab legs were so good. If it wasn't for these shells, you would have never known. It's dessert time. I'm gonna get, thank you, something called, um, I think the chocolate or peanut butter explosion. I don't know y'all, but it sounds like it would be really, really good. So we wanna see what it look like. And you won't believe, <clears throat> my waiter told me that 22 is significant in his life as well. So crazy. So crazy. Happy 22nd. Thank Happy 22nd to you. Thank you. Oh, no, that was so sweet. Thank so you. I appreciate it. Be I appreciate it. Did y'all hear him say happy 22nd? Ah. Now, this is what I did every month in 2022. <sighs> Happy anniversary. Okay, I'm getting a little frizzy. The life of a girl with natural hair. But that was amazing. It was a very, very good experience. If I had gone there before um, going to Nobu, then I'd be all right. But Nobu is a special place in my heart, you guys. Um, but it was good. I definitely had my bag to go. Hey, what's up you guys? Editing Sarah here. Once again, I forgot to close out the vlog properly. So I wanted to come on and just say thank you guys so, so much for watching. Thank you for all of your support. We are growing. And if you are not subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you are, I appreciate you. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Oh. And coincidentally, this happens to be my 22nd Weekend With Me vlog. Thank you guys so, so much for all of your support. And happy 22. It's all about the end. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. It's all about the antidote.